Hey, good evening, everybody. Welcome back to Breaking the Ice. We are here tonight for another group break from the Penguins. Uh, welcome to everybody that's returning that's uh, involved with tonight's breaks. And uh, if you're just tuning in for the first time to check it out, thank you for tuning along. Tonight, we've got two breaks, the identical things, uh, and some fun stuff going on. We have uh, 2019-20 AHL hockey, NHL, and we have a double Penguins bounty going on. If we pull a KC DeSmith autograph out of the AHL box or an Emil Larmy Young Guns out of the upper deck box of the Series 1 box, we're giving away extra jerseys tonight. As always, we give away jerseys with every break that we do. Good evening to everybody out there. Hey, Nicholas, Leland, Carl, and Cody. First off, big happy birthday to Carl out there. Maybe this is your day, Carl. We're hoping uh, that you are rewarded big time today. Thanks to our good friends at SteelCityCollectibles.com for getting these boxes to us. They do a great job, and we're happy to have them along as friends and uh, in the breaking world here, in the card collecting world. Um, so thanks to those guys. Lots of fun news. we got hockey coming back tomorrow. The Penguins kicking off the season at 5.30 tomorrow afternoon. News out of Wilkes-Barre. Kevin Porter's back with the team as an assistant coach. And uh, lots of activity going on in the office. It's getting busier and busier, and plans are coming together as we get closer to February here when the AHL is scheduled to hit the ice. It's going to be a really, really, really busy time uh, to go there. Uh, so we'll be uh, staying here, breaking, though, hopefully through that, the entire time and, and having a good time with you guys online as well as watching hockey with you guys in the very near future. Carl Leland is all taken care of. No worries. He's got spots in both breaks. So thank you guys for donating a couple spots to him. I think you guys are going to make do makeups with him later on, you and Brandy. So he is set. Uh, we got all of our breakers set. We'll share our list with you in a second. Uh, as always, we're going to give away um, uh, some good stuff tonight, some prizes for the uh, top spots in our breaks later on, and uh, some cool stuff. Hopefully, maybe we'll pull a Lafreniere tonight, too. Who knows? We haven't pulled one yet out of our upper deck series, one that we've used so far this year, but we'll see tonight. So without further ado, we'll keep the chat going uh, as we go here and we'll have some fun uh, with all the stuff we've got going on here. So I'm going to show you guys right now the lists for tonight, the breakers that are involved, and we'll get things rolling here. So break number, mixer number 26, the first break tonight. Carmen and Brandy, both free spots in there for buying in on their 10th breaks. And then uh, J.J. Mullen, my buddy around the corner, Jason Savarino, Carl, Tim, Brandy, Leland from Brandy, Jason Barr, Corey, uh, Brad is back in, one of our newer breakers. Brad, thanks for sticking around. Chris K., Chris L., Stephen P., who's another one of our newer guys. Thanks, Stephen. I'm glad you're sticking around with us, too. Kurt's back in. Uh, Cody is, is here as well. And then for our second break tonight, here's the rundown of the folks that are in there. Corey, Brandy, Kurt, Chris K., uh, K. Erickson, who's another uh, one of our newer breakers as well. Uh, Jeremy's back. Carl Leland getting a spot from Carl. Nice job there, Carl. Steven is in there too. John Italia, my buddy out there in State College. Brad, Tim D., Vasilios, got a bunch of spots there. Patty, Nicholas, Cody, Savarino, uh, Brad again, and Cody again. So those are all of the folks we have participating tonight. Uh, and we're going to have a good time doing it. So let's get the uh, – there you go. Very nice there, Leland. That's what it's all about. It's all about community and helping out whenever we can, making sure everybody's getting a chance to uh, buy in here. Uh, I will post another break tomorrow. I've got some other product here. I just didn't have time with everything going on in the office to get the season going here. Didn't have time to get it up online today, but I will post something uh, tomorrow for you guys, uh, two boxes of something, and we'll have some fun with those next week. Um, so yeah, that's it. Um, let's get things ready here. Let's randomize some lists and, uh, get right into things. What do you say? So we're going to now share random.org where we do all of our randomizations. Obviously you guys have been around long enough now to know 
We're going to do the teams first. So uh, you're getting an AHL and an NHL team in each of the breaks tonight. So we're putting those in there, and then we will uh, randomize, and we'll put them up on the, the board there so everybody can see it and figure out how your teams are. We'll also, as always, have a little time there if anybody's looking to make some trades going on. Uh, and then we'll randomize the jerseys, whatever jerseys we're giving away a little bit later uh, in the show as well. So let's get this rolling here. We've got our teams, 14 rounds on this first one. Lots of activity in the office this week. It's fun to get back into the hockey season here. Uh, starting to pick up really in the office. Lots of going on. UJX TQ. TK -Q is the uh, code for that mix up there. Uh, if you guys haven't had a chance, they're making some improvements to the arena as well. Um, so you'll see some... Uh, if you go onto our uh, Instagram page today, uh, you can see kind of some of the changes that they're making over there to the club seat section. And they've got a couple other things that are in the hopper too that we were made privy to today. So some exciting things that when we are allowed to have fans back in uh, will be cool to see. Also uh, some surprises coming up. Um, I'll release it to you guys first today. We're going to be doing some of those fan cutouts. So if you can't come to the games right now and you still want to act like you're at the games, we're going to be selling those fan cutouts online, hopefully later this week, if not later this week, first thing next week. So you can get yourself into the building, even though you're not in the building. W-I-Y-B-T-I. W-I-Y-B-T-I. So we'll have information on how you guys can all be involved with that coming up in the very near future. If you uh, so uh, choose to be. And we are going to now copy these over for you guys. Building our uh, graphic here for you real quickly. As, uh, as I'm doing this, throw up a couple comments from you guys from the chatter here. So glad you guys could all join us again tonight as usual. We're going to have some good times here. Hopefully pull some cool cards and make everyone's day. Not just everyone's day, but especially a special day for Carl. Let's get Carl. Let's, what can we do for Carl to make his birthday better? That's what we need to be asking ourselves tonight. Carl has been in almost every break we've done and has not sniffed a jersey yet. What if he won two tonight? Or even three or four if we end up getting the uh, hitting the bounties. I got a feeling we might there might be some bounty coming tonight. Could be. Could be. Todd Kenny, Todd, you can't win. You didn't, you didn't buy in, man. If you're just sitting around and you, it's the first time uh, you've, you've checked us out, um, the way to get into um, uh, any of our breaks is through the Dash auction app. We put that information up online. So, Todd, if you are interested, uh, be sure to check out uh, Dash tomorrow. And we should have some information there to help you out. Let's see here. I'm going to... Pull up this overlay for you guys so you can see your teams. There we go. So there are the teams. Uh, I'm going to take the comments down for a minute so you guys can see your teams. We'll give you guys all a minute or two to uh, check them out, see what you're interested in. I'm just going to open the box right now. I'm not opening any packs. I'm going to get things situated here so we can move. So Trades are open. If anybody is looking to trade their teams, uh, throw it into the chat. I will help coordinate that if you guys are on different platforms. And we will make that a reality if possible. Carl accepts George Brett cards, he said. He's a big George Brett collector uh, on the baseball side of things. So uh, if you don't have hockey jerseys, you can always send him some George Brett cards. Some cool stuff there. Let's see. Arizona is available from Tim. 
So if anybody is looking for Arizona, Leland loves the abs and the pens. So if anybody's willing to trade those, Randy's got his abs, he said. So we'll give it a minute or two here for trades. Uh, yeah, as I said, a lot of activity in the office these days, um, going through protocols and how we do things safely and have uh, make sure that the players and the staff and the crews that are still working the games. Oh, Randy's got Colorado up for grabs. Randy's got Colorado up for grabs there, uh, Leland, if you are interested. So you guys can sort that out. That's right, Carl. So, Nicholas, if you are, you always keep your eyes on that Facebook group. I know you're in there. Uh, set your alerts on for that. I always post in there before I post it to the general public. So, uh, Dallas for the Avs is something that uh, Leland is looking for. Brandy, let's know. Let's see if uh, that's something you're interested in. Brandy is also interested in the Bruins. And Cody is looking for Philly for Minnesota, if possible. Um, anybody up for those trades? Philly is up by Brandy, so Brandy and Cody. Philly for Minnesota, maybe. Tim, there is a very good chance. Brandy's going to do Philly for Minnesota. So uh, let me make some notes here while well, you guys. But, uh, yeah, Tim. Uh, we are planning out some things for jerseys. And I definitely want to roll out the Star Wars jerseys. And uh, and then Brandy also is going to trade Leland for Dallas. So that's going to be Dallas for the Avs. Correct. Let's see. Um, but if you know we're playing in the May, so May fourth seems like an awfully good time to do a Star Wars game. So we're uh, got that tentatively planned right now. So Leland says awesome and thank you. So the trades that I have so far are Philly for Minnesota and Dallas for Colorado. Anything else? Anything else? Anything else? Dallas for Colorado. Philly for Minnesota. Brandy loves the Bruins, so she would take the Bruins if anybody has those available. And we will uh, give it another minute here. By this time tomorrow, the Pittsburgh Penguins game should be close to uh, coming to a completion. First game of the NHL season. It should be fun. So, uh, anybody else? I'm going to uh, call trades closed here and get things rolling. And let's have some fun. And Brandy says, sure thing, and thank you, Leland. So let's call those trades closed. If anything changes in the next minute, hey, Brandy, May 4th is her birthday. We're hoping to have fans, you know, knock on wood, we can get some fans in the building by then uh, if things settle down a bit. But right now, even if not, I still think that would be a fun time to wear them, and uh, you guys can still wear, watch the games online. So here we go. Trades are now closed. Let's get going. So first pack here of our – we'll do AHL followed by NHL. We'll go through these pretty close. Cameron Gauntz, hey, he texted me last week during the show. I don't know if you, remember, you guys remember. Uh, he's doing really well, it sounded like. Had a nice little conversation with him afterwards. So we're looking for that Casey DeSmith auto in this box. There should be two autographs per AHL box. So we're looking for a Casey DeSmith in order to give away a Casey DeSmith jersey tonight. So nothing in that first pack. Let's keep it moving. Tim and Brad just checking in. Hey, guys. Good to see you guys. Tim Thompson. Brad. Here to celebrate Carl's birthday with him. That's why we're all here tonight. That and cards. And we're looking out for Casey the Smith. Here 
Reed Boucher, there we go. Two packs down. Yes, uh, Chris just chimed in with uh, Casey was doing a signing out in Pittsburgh. Uh, yeah, it would be nice to have a jersey to get out there with him. I'm sure it's not the last one he'll ever do. Yeah, once we get back to a little bit more normal world, probably do some in-person things as well. Dan Vladar. DiPietro. A lot of goaltenders in this set, that's for sure. Let's see what let's keep it going. We gotta find those autographs here. And then the uh the bigger cards will come out of the upper deck series one that we've got. Hopefully find some cool stuff from that box tonight. Cam Schilling, Aiden Hill. So many goalies, Leland. I know. I know. It's like your dream come true. There's another one. So many goalies at the AHL level. Isaac Ratcliffe. We're excited. We got a couple players have actually made their way into town already. There's a first auto of the night. Reed Boucher, the Utica Comets slash Vancouver Canucks. Utica Vancouver. That one is going out to Carmen. Got two free spots in tonight's break for being in 10 breaks before this. So congratulations, Carmen. Uh, a couple guys have made their way back into town. Um, there is a uh, quarantine protocol and that kind of stuff, so they haven't been in the rink yet or into the locker room even, but they are uh, quarantining now and getting ready to hit the ice in the next couple of days. So a small group in now, and we'll get a lot more in. Uh, training camp should start sometime late next week, officially. And then not too far away from there, game time at the NHL level. Phoenix Copley, Kenny Agostino. There's the Smith. No auto on that one. Who's got the pens in this one? In this break, anyway. Tim's got the pens. So Tim, that'll be coming your way. Is that KC the Smith? We're just keeping our fingers crossed for another one. One that might have an autograph on it. Mr. Gaunce again. Stefan Nason. Yeah, Cody, uh, I believe uh, Mr. Larmy is, is en route. I believe he is en route to Wilkes-Barre, and uh, you should see him pretty soon. Uh, I believe probably uh, there's a, one goalie down in Wheeling that will probably be joining us, uh, and that's what we'll have for now. Uh, there's a chance that they don't keep all four goalies up in Pittsburgh all year. They may uh, – that the uh, practice squad there or the the, the, uh, the Aces squad or whatever you want to call it, they do have the, op the ability to send players down from that to the AHL. Now, I know they're not going to want to do that a lot for COVID reasons, but I wouldn't be surprised if you saw – a couple of moves there during the season. So um, maybe Mr. Dorio comes down and plays a game or two as well. We'll see about that. But, yes, I do know that Mr. Larmy should be joining us in the near future. That was reported out of Pittsburgh today as well, as a matter of fact. Lucas Elvens. Shane Sterrett. That's a Penguins goaltender at this point, actually playing down there in Wheeling right now. Possibility of seeing him in, up here in a, a Penguins uniform in the not-too-distant future. P.O., he's up there on that practice squad in Pittsburgh. Looking to make an impact at some point this year. Hopefully he gets into a couple games. That's right, Logan. Let's go Pens, indeed. Let's go Pens. Can't wait till tomorrow. I know where I'll be at 5.30, right in front of my TV. Looking for that second auto. 
out of this first box. A couple packs left. We've already pulled one auto. It's that Reed Boucher from Utica slash Vancouver. Some wheeling jerseys, Carl. Would you like some wheeling gaming horns? I can put a call in and see if that's something we can do at some point. Saw so somebody, I can't remember who it was on the breaker page, has gone down to wheeling and got uh, Ryan Scarfo to sign their jersey. Ryan is a great guy, one of my favorites from the last couple of years up here in Wilkesbury. Always happy to help out, always uh, willing to go the extra mile. So I'm glad somebody had a good uh, experience with him as well. Super guy. Glad to see him in playing the wheeling. I know he was supposed to be in writing, and then uh, their seat, they, they backed out of the season. So um, glad he landed on his feet and got a chance to, to shoot, suit it up right now. Let's see here. What are we going to get there? Rem Pitlick. Rem Pitlick, Milwaukee. It's funny. I think we, we pulled a couple of Pitlick autographs of a NHL product before. Milwaukee, that's going out to Chris K, Chris K, Chris King. There you go. So two autos out of there. No to Smith. Oh, Jason Ward was it was Jason. Played in Charleston. Oh, good. Well, I'm glad you got a chance. Uh, he, he, Scarf is a great guy. One of my favorites. If you if you see him next time they're down there, tell him I said hi. He knows me. I know him. Good buddy of mine. So yeah, the Admirals jerseys are cool, Leland. I agree with you there. So those are our two uh, our two autos out of there, Reed Boucher and Rem Pitlick. No to Smith on that first box, but we do have another box coming up, so maybe we hit in there. So that is break number one. AHL product. We're moving on now. Series one. Crack this bad boy open. Let's see what we can get. Oh, it's. Well, there you go, Jay. Well, at least you got to see the, our, our affiliate down there. I'm glad you had a good opportunity, a good chance to chat with Ryan as well. Really good guy. Really good guy. So let's pull these young – let's pull six young guns in this box, it says. Maybe we pull a canvas as well. Who knows? Those canvas young guns are pretty fun. So there we go. Let's get ripping here. Truba, Pavelski. We'll go through pretty fast through here and stop at the big hits. Like that debut dates, Caden Primo, December 5th, Avalanche versus Canadians. That's for Montreal. That's a cool looking card. I haven't seen one of these debut dates yet, I don't think. That's going out to Brad. Brad Hudak checking in. There you go, Brad. Nate Schmidt. The Goose is loose. Alex Goligoski. Zach Cassian. Kirby Dach. Dach. All, by the way, uh, all mailing has gone out now from the last couple of weeks here. So you should have your packages on their way if you haven't received them yet. Oh, we got a Dazzler coming up here. Um, Sebastian Ajo, Carolina, Pink Dazzler. Carolina, that is going out to Carl. There you go, Carl. Birthday boy, Carl. Congratulations, bud. Pink Dazzler. I think that might be a... I don't think that's a normal one. Hey, Rosie, my little my little cat friend Rosie's coming in to see us, guys. It's a nice dazzler there. Uh, Leland says Caden's on his list for jerseys. He's going to try and collect that. Keep your eyes open. Gallagher. Jack Eichel. There's our first Young Guns, Jonas Johansson, Buffalo.
Buffalo. Let's go, Buffalo. That is for Steven. New guy, Steven. Congratulations, pal. One of the up-and-comers there in the Sabres. And, uh, hey, uh, Bill, I saw you uh, had opened a box of Synergy online today. That was – did a nice little break of your own there on the page and you pulled a Lafreniere out of that Synergy, huh? Nice little pull. See you, Rosie. She's running downstairs now. She's going to see her mom. Nicholas, that's a good question. Nicholas is asking when the schedule will be released. I don't know. Um, they actually haven't put it together yet, bud. Um but as soon as it is, you will be sure to see it on WBSPenguins.com and uh, all of our social media sites. We will get that out fast, fast, fast. Uh, it's not going to be a very complicated schedule to put together this year just because most of the buildings, there's nothing else going on in them, and you're only playing a select number of teams. So it'll be a pretty easy schedule to, to put together. Uh, so it'll be pretty fast. Adam Fox. There's Braden Point. Bowen Byram, Young Guns for the Avalanche. And that was one of the traded teams there. I believe that is going out to Leland. Congrats, Leland. Bowen Byram from the Avalanche. There's a Carter Hart. I just sent out a couple of rack packages, and I sent a Carter Hart out to a, a Philly fan there. hope he appreciates that. Even if it does come in a Wilkes-Barre Scranton envelope. <laughs> Can't wait to see his reaction. Hopefully he drops me a line and lets me know. Jake Gensel. There's Ovi. Gusev there with the Devils. Quinn Hughes. There's our canvas, Ryan Sutter. For Minnesota. I believe that was another one of our traded teams. There you go. Nice canvas version there. Lars Eller, Morgan Riley, the Toronto. Keeping our eyes out for that Emil Army. Young Guns. Emil's a fun guy. Maybe I'll bring him on to the breaks one night with us. See if he can pull his own card. Bernier. We got an OV upper deck portraits there. There's a Pasternak, Bo Horvat, Carlson. So, yeah, as I mentioned, all the cards from the last couple of weeks are now officially out the door. Jerseys for you guys that won jerseys are on their way. Um, pucks, all that kind of stuff. If you haven't received them yet from last week, uh, just keep your eyes on your mailboxes. Should be there very soon. Debrinkat. Left bomb. What do we have here? Rookie retrospective. Martin Neckash. 2019-20 rookie retrospective. That is for Carolina. Carolina. That I believe that is. Uh, who is that again? Was that Carolina again? Carl. Here you go, Carl. Birth, little birthday luck rubbing off on you. Jordan Bennington. Uh, Logan, yeah, hey Logan, nice to see you. Welcome aboard. Watch for watching. Uh, yeah, we're just gonna be. It's gonna be. Uh, so from what I hear is uh, everyone's staying very local. There may be some very small crossover, but uh, you're gonna see the Penguins playing Hershey, Lehigh Valley. Um, Binghamton, who is actually playing out of uh, the New Jersey Devils practice facility, Syracuse, perhaps Utica. I think those are the teams we're going to be facing off against. Another canvas, Braden Point there. Braden Point for Tampa Bay. That's for Kurt. But, yeah, it's going to be very, uh, very uh, – 
almost like its own little bubble, a traveling bubble, if you will. So it'll be very limited, the teams that each each division is playing. They've came up with uh, unique divisions this year, especially with the three teams not participating and some teams sharing prospects. So it's going to be just a little bit different this year, but could be get interesting. Could make it really uh, hot right off the bat there. Predominant Jonathan Huberdeau for the Florida Panthers. Florida, that's going out to Jason Severino. Thomas Tatar, Sanheim, Backland, Barkov. Keep rolling, rolling, rolling. There's Phil the Thrill. Oh, I see something coming up there. Another Young Guns coming up here. We'll see who it is. There's Ryan Ellis, Jake Ottinger. We pulled a couple of those in the past. That's Dallas. That's one of our trades for tonight. Dallas for Colorado. So uh, that one's going out to Brandy. Congratulations, Brandy. Zach Parise. Gino. Doogie Hamilton there. And Boone Jenner. So the two cards that we've really been looking for out of this Series 1, we haven't pulled in any of the boxes we've opened. Lafreniere and Emil Larmé. Let's see what we come up with tonight. Ah, here's something. you got to pay attention to these. Who's got Nashville tonight? Nashville, Chris King. This is the French variant, variant Francais. So that is a short print there. So if you turn it over, everything's in French. So there you go. That's a nice uh, French version. There you go, Leland. I'm not sure that, it, you know, they're, they're kind of tricky to see. We may have pulled one in the past and I just didn't see it. Uh, I actually won one in a break and um, from somebody else and uh, – didn't realize it until later in the process as well once it got to my house. Uh, they're very difficult unless you're really looking at reading the back of the card. Um, so that Rocco Grimaldi, that is the uh, Francais, the French version. So congratulations there. We got another Young Guns coming up here. Uh, or so, Oh, it's a Dazzler. Patrick Kane Dazzler for Chicago. It's going out to Patty. Congratulations, Patty. Anze Kopitar, Brandon Tanev there. Let's see here. What do we got in this pack? Bobby Ryan, Nathan McKinnon, Alexander True, Young Guns, that is for San Jose. The Sharks, that is going out to Chris Lashevsky. Here you go, Chris. Stay lock. Yamamoto and Marner. So we've got three or four young guns in there right now. We're still gunning for a couple more. Nylander. Keith Yandel. Brock Nelson portraits. Becky, James Neal, Jerron, D'Angelo. Believe we got another Young Guns coming up here from the looks of the backs. Connor Garland, Tara Vinen, Philip Karushev from the Blackhawks. Chicago, as we just pulled another Chicago a couple seconds ago, uh, going out to Patty. Ben Bishop. There's your 
requisite goaltenders in that pack. Saros for Nashville. This is the sideways pack. There's another canvas, three canvas in that pack. Evander Kane. Or three canvas in the box, I should say. I think that's a little odd. Seems like a high number. Grubauer there. Kasperi Kapanen still looking to get into his first practice with Pittsburgh. Immigration delays in the age of COVID. Make that a little bit difficult. Travel and the quarantining and all that kind of stuff. It's funny with the travel. Uh, you have to quarantine before you travel. You have to quarantine after you get to your destination. So lots of activity whenever those players are coming over. What do we got here? Worldwide, Sidney Crosby. NHL Worldwide with that flag, flag behind it. <laughs> Whoever <laughs> the shark sends everybody five dollars. Let's keep it rolling. Get rid of all these wrappers here in a minute. There's the Grimaldi, but that is the unfrancais, so the English version there. There's Mr. Matthews with his creepy mustache. PK, Dylan Larkin, Gerard, predominant Nashville, Roman Yossi. A couple of Nashville hits out of this box already. Connor Hutton, Jordan Eberle. There we go. Let's get this thing open without damaging anything. Zach Hyman. Mr. Orlov. Another canvas. There's your Young Guns canvas. Nicholas Baudouin. Chicago. Again, another Chicago. Congratulations, Patty. Carlson. Kerfoot, another worldwide, that one, Ben Bishop for Dallas. That's another one of our trades there. Oops. Kemper, Jones, and Forsberg. Two packs left here. We're getting down to the nitty-gritty to see if we pull one of our bounties tonight. Braden Shen, John Marino, rookie card there from the Penguins defenseman, Alexander Alexeyev from the Capitals. There's another young gun, Washington. That is going out to Brad. Brad's got a couple of hits tonight. Congratulations, Brad. And last pack of the first break here, and then we'll get to our jersey giveaway and our prizes, and then we'll move into break number two. Let's see what we got here. Riley Smith, Zuccarello. Oh, we got a little game-worn jersey action. Jack War Zach Warensky, game-worn jersey. That is for Columbus, the Blue Jackets. 
And that is going out to Patty. There you go, Patty. Congratulations. Nice little jersey patch in there. Very cool. Matthew Shane, Ekblad, and Donsky. So, no bounties. No bounties. But lots of fun. Lots of nice hits there. Lots of good stuff in break number one. Let me get everything organized here so we don't lose track of who gets what out of the breaks. So this is break number one going back into the box. Let me grab the AHL cards and throw them in here too. Oh, a little earthquake there. Hit the camera. Nicholas, I saw you asking what kind of camera I use. I don't know. It's just something I bought online. I don't think it's anything fancy. Uh, so I can't really give that answer right now. Just a little overhead camera I've got. Boo on no bounties. I agree. But let's have some fun anyway. First things first, we are going to open up Let's see here. My master breakers list here. Here are the jerseys we have remaining. So first thing we're going to do is randomize tonight's jerseys to find out which jersey we are giving away this evening. So well, I guess first things I'm going to do here. Hold on a second. Get rid of this overlay so you guys can all see what's going on. And I'm going to also stop sharing that so they didn't get that weird looking thing there. So let's go back into uh, random.org. First thing we're going to do here is figure out which jersey we are giving away tonight. So whatever lands at the top will be the jersey that we are presenting to one of our breakers tonight. And then we will randomize the list from that break. So there are 24 jerseys that we have available tonight. Let's see. The one that lands at the very top after round 13 is going to be the jersey we give away this evening. Good luck here. Hopefully it's a player you enjoyed watching. Jan Drozg. Black Jan Drozg jersey. So before, first things first here. I'm going to uh, update my spreadsheet so I know which jersey we are giving away. Black Jan Droz jersey. And then we're going to pull the breakers back in here. We will do a new one, and this is going to de determine tonight's prize winners. So, top spot will win the Droz jersey. The next four spots win secondary prizes. Let's get it rolling. We've got 11 on the rounds. Good luck to everybody. Good luck to everybody tonight. Three, two... One, and tonight's winner, Chris Lyshevsky. Top spot, JJ, second, Steven, Cody, and Carl. Carl, you got a, you got a, uh, slipped in there with a prize. Slipped in there with one tonight. Getting closer, creeping up there. Let me put our uh, winners into my spot here so I have it on the, Let's see here. So, Chris Lashevsky, congratulations, Chris. JJ, Steven, Cody, and Carl. The next one's in line there. So, there you go. Now we're going to move on to our next break. Break 27. And we're going to randomize the teams again like we did in the past. Randomize the uh, participants, give a minute or two for trades, and we'll get going with our next 
round here. So let's get these teams situated. Six on the randomization. That's good. Let's keep the numbers low here so we can get through this fast. There we go. Flyers at the top. Chicago at the bottom. R-G-E-H-Q-B. This is in break 27. Our second break tonight. And now we'll grab tonight's participants in our second break. I'll give you a quick look at those. So we're going down from the top. We got Corey, Brandy, Kurt, Chris, K, K. Erickson, Jeremy C's in there, Carl, Leland, Steven, John, Italia, Basilios has got a bunch of spots in there. Jason Savarino's in there as well. So let's get these guys randomized. We got 11 on this one. Good luck, everybody. Hopefully you all land on the teams that you love. See what we got going on here. Two, one, and Corey D at the top. Jason Savarino at the bottom. F E D N H B is what we've got here. Let me pop these names into into my spreadsheet and I will make the overlay for you guys. So you can all see in just a moment which teams you ended up with. And give me one minute. Okay, let's save this one as 27 for our overlay. Can you believe we've been doing this that long, guys, to have 27 different breaks as well as some off-the-wall kind of things we've done in the past. So let's take that out. Hey, Tyler, just tuning in for the first time tonight, Tyler. You think it's awesome? Well, I have to get you involved here coming up. Anybody watching tonight that's interested, uh, drop a note into the chat, and I will uh, hit you up with some information on how you can join in. Brad, we're glad you found it, too. We don't do anything crazy. We don't get too, uh, you know, Try to keep the prices reasonable as well as give away some good prizes. So, Brad, uh, glad you found it. There are Al, – Al Crampton is interested. Okay, Al, uh, I will uh, check in with you. I'll drop you a message later on, let you know how we do it, um, how you get involved, and, and we'll get you guys uh, in here sometime. I love it. Uh, so there are the – again, we got the names a little bit broken up, but I think you guys can figure it out. Take a look. Anybody – Open for trades. Uh, if you are interested in any trades, throw them into the chat right now. And we can make that happen, or we can try to make it happen. Just going to get things situated here so we can move a little bit faster. And hopefully we have a little luck with some of our bounties in this second break. Tyler Iser is interested. Great. Tyler, I will definitely reach out to you. Leland says Buffalo is available. Arizona is available from Tim. Please, someone take Arizona, he said. Leland's got Buffalo available for somebody. Candy, there you go. Cool. You're watching on uh, Twitter over there. Um, so the best thing to do, guys, is we have a private breakers page on Facebook. If you go over there and search for Breaking the Ice, uh, you can put in a request to join it. I'll check you out a little bit behind the scenes just to make sure you're a good fit. And then I will, uh, uh, uh I'll approve you for it. And that's where we announce all of our breaks in advance. So if you're interested, uh, make sure you try to find that. If you can't find it, what I'll do is tonight, I will put the, the link to that page on our regular penguins, uh, page. So you guys can track that down and, um, 
and hopefully get involved. We love welcoming new people in. Uh, new breakers get a little bit something special in their first break that they do with us. We give away prizes all the time, we give away a jersey with every break, um, a Penguins game worn or game issue jersey. So uh, we try to have a really good time with it and have some fun. Tim's looking for uh, Tim and Leland. You guys looking to swap here, Arizona for Buffalo? Let us know. Leland is all in for that, so we're going to do an Arizona Buffalo swap. Jot that down. Yeah. Opening day, we can't you can't beat it, right? Opening day tomorrow. Hard to believe. So Leland and uh, Tim have done a nice little trade there. Give it another 30 seconds or so here. Anybody else interested in a trade? Let's hear it. If not, we are going to get breaking and hopefully find some bounties in this second one here. Okay, I think we're good. If anything changes in the next minute or two, we will readjust. But let's get cracking here. Get rolling. Open up some AHL packs. See if we can find that Casey the Smith auto. That is what we are looking for. Let's see what we got here. This AHL is not a huge product. You know, there's not a huge set, but some young stars in here, some people like P.O. Joseph that uh, interest Penguins fans, and you know, hopefully we get that KC to Smith auto. Shane Bowers. Aho. Be interesting to see if they put out an AHL set this year. I don't know if they're going to have the opportunity to do it because of the short season and uh, and all that kind of stuff. But we'll see, hopefully. Um, make something work out of it. Let's see. Evan Bouchard, Dan Vladar, Phillips. Phoenix Copley. If you're looking for some, I think next week we're going to do something. Uh, I don't have any more AHL boxes right now, but I'll, See if I can grab round something up. There's the Smith, but no auto. So uh, let's see who who's got Pittsburgh this one. Kurt L. Kurt has got the Penguins in the second break here. Uh, I'll see if I can round up a an AHL box for next week. Got a couple of NHL boxes hanging around here. And Mike, once again, I mean, you guys keep buying me out here. I, I don't order a lot of product at one time. Like, you know, we're not regular breakers here. We're not like these big time guys. We do one week, one break a week or two breaks a week to have some fun and meet up and talk some hockey uh, where those guys are stacking up the boxes. We I buy just enough to get us through and, uh, and have some fun. But I'll see if I can put in another order. Uh, you guys wiped me out last week quick. You know, wiped me out with these two. I do have a couple of NHL boxes here that I can throw up for a break next week. And we'll see what we can do here. Might slow down a little bit there, you know, depending on what our schedule turns out to be. We'll have to see how often we are able to get together here. Hopefully it's still every week. Um, if not every week, it'll be every other week. Or, you know, we might have to change meets or something like that. But once the season starts, <laughs> a case break, Brad. Well, we'd have to find the right product. What product would you like to see in a case break, Brad? Anybody have any uh, – any, uh, We would, I would do it if you guys are up for it. But we'd have to find the right product at a – you know, I, I wouldn't want to kill you with price on something like that. That can get a little bit pricey if you have the wrong product there or the right product, you know what I mean, like really good product. Um, I'm not opposed to it, though, if you guys would be up for it. A case break of synergy, you say, Brad. What's everybody else think of that? 
a case break of Synergy. I actually like the Synergy. I know it, it kind of got a bad rap from some people. Um, but the more I, you know, we opened a couple boxes of it a couple weeks ago, and I've seen the new stuff, and I, I think it's, uh, I, I kind of like it. That might be a little pricey. <laughs> I don't know if the Penguins would front the bill for that one. We'd have to see. Sam Carrick, first autograph of the night. San Diego Gulls. San Diego is, that is going to be with Anaheim. And that is for Vasilios. There you go, Vasilios. Aiden Hill. Josh Norris. Another Shane Sterrett. You know what, Brad? I'll have to look into that. That could be fun. We've never done anything that big on this, but maybe for like something special coming up, like maybe a, a pre-opening night break or something, we could get away with that. Let me put some feelers out. Let me just see about that. There's P.O. You guys are going to hear a lot from P.O. coming up here in the next year or two, I think. He's going to be a really good player at the NHL level. Really nice guy, too. So, Brad, one of the things that it's it, it, it's not pricey, and there are some, you're right. Uh, I think one of the things that a lot of serious breakers give on is that it's just it's too many parallels and too many colors and things like that. But I kind of liked what we what we pulled out of it a couple of weeks ago. We did pull a couple autos out of it too, so that's worth looking into. Maybe I'll throw a, a little poll up there on the um, a poll up there on the uh, our breakers page and see. Have to come up with a fair price point and all that kind of stuff for you guys. Still looking for our second auto. It looks like it might be coming out of the final pack. I'd have to find a really good jersey to give away with that too, if we did a case break like that. I'd have to find a top-notch jersey for you guys. Rupsov, Trey Batherson, Alexei Haponimi from Springfield. Springfield and Florida. That's going to Vasilios, too. He cornered the market in the autos on the first box. Congratulations, Vasilios. So, unfortunately, no DeSmith auto out of this week's break. We will keep trying. We'll keep looking. We'll see what we got. Let's move on to the big boy now. And here we're looking for the A Mill Army. I hope we give it away tonight. And if we don't, we might buy another box or two of this. And once he gets into town or into North America, maybe I'll video chat him in so he can help out with the situation. I have to ask them. I don't know if they have hockey cards over in Finland. Leland's looking forward to the game use boxes, and those are that's a nice product, nice higher end product. Every now and then, I might pop and buy something a little bit more like that for you serious breakers, but we always try to keep this relatively uh, affordable for everybody here. Tack on a couple extra bucks for the jersey raffle. The basically you're buying a a raffle ticket with every break that you do with us. So we tack a couple extra bucks in there, but still try to keep it price point friendly for you guys. Here we go. We got a checklist split there already. Tyler Mears, Kevin Fiala, the flower, Mark Andre Fleury. For Vegas, who's got Vegas in this one? The Vegas, that's going out to Jeremy. Congratulations, Jeremy. P. 
PK again. Start to see a pattern in these packs after a while. PK is always on top. Lilligren. So for the base cards, it looks like there's a little bit of a pattern sometimes. Carter Hart there. Got a couple ideas for some other uh, things that are coming up that we're going to do on Dash um, around St. Patrick's Day. Kiefer Bellows, Young Gun. That's a decent one. New York Islanders. New York Islanders. That is going out to Brittany. Congratulations, Brittany. Kiefer Bellows. Uh, idea for a, a St. Patrick's Day kind of. Uh, surprise online there with some old St. Patch jerseys I have. Yeah, Leland, I think you're right. Bellows is going to be a really good player. So that's uh, that you might want to hold on to that card for a little bit. There's Latang, Chuck, Galino. Aha! Rookie retrospective, Kale McCarr for Colorado. Who's got the abs in this one? Steven. There you go, Steven, one of our newer breakers. That's a really nice card there from a one of the top rookies from last year. The top rookie from last year, as a matter of fact. Kale McCarr. Very cool. Neil Pionk, Jordan Everly. Yeah, it would have to be a it would have to be a big jersey for a, a case break. I would find something special. <laughs> I don't think he would do that, Brad. I don't think he would do that. Let's see here. Eric Stahl, canvas. That's going out to uh, Minnesota. Sorry about that, guys. Look, coming, got that shot right through the uh, the photo uh, hole there. It's going out to Jeremy. I do have a – I'm doing a favor for somebody out in Pittsburgh, though, and he's going to owe me a little something. Somebody that works for – we're doing a little – helping out with a charity product, project they're doing out there, so – I will be owed something, and maybe I'll pull in a, a favor for you guys through that. Who can say? Kempe. There's Marino again. Riley Smith. We got another canvas here. Shabbat. Upper deck canvas. Those canvas cards are cool. The photos that they use on there are really nice. That's for Ottawa. Jeremy again. Morgan Riley. Let's get it going here. Zuccarello. Darnell Nurse. Kerfoot. Worldwide, Brad Marchand. For Boston. It's going out to Brad again. <laughs> That's not a bad idea, Cody. I was actually working with the email, uh, Mr. Alarmy, last year on a an idea for uh, Cancer Night with his pads, and it just didn't, it, we didn't have enough time to pull it off and do it correctly. Um, he's a guy that's interested in doing that kind of stuff, so he likes to have fun. Carl counted his Brett cards today. I'm bet you you have 66, Carl. George Brett he's talking about, guys. If you guys don't know who George Brett is, if you're too young to remember George Brett, he was one of the best third basemen you'll ever see played baseball. How many you got there, Carl? I'm still surprised you didn't jump at all those free ones that were on uh, the Discord the other day. Here we go, Young Guns. Mikhail Burden for the Winnipeg Jets. 
More than that, I'm assuming, Carl. Winnipeg is going out to... It's going out to Patty. She's got a couple of young guns out of these packs, that are out of the uh, breaks tonight. I'm going to venture it's way more than 66, Carl. I just got a nice, I, I did a nice little purchase off online of uh, some vintage Pittsburgh Pirates cards. It was about 70 cards uh, and a couple of uh, low grade Clementes and Stargels, some, two of my favorite players, and Dave Parker. Uh, he is my favorite player. So uh, I was happy to get those in the mail yesterday. Look at that. Is that, that must be a short print. Jordan Bington wearing the suit. That looks like a real short print there. 757 different George Brett cards. That's amazing. That's insane, Carl. I had no idea. I didn't know they made that many George Brett cards. This Bennington, though, is uh, this is a pretty interesting card here. St. Louis, Jason Savarino. I do believe that is probably a short print. You know it, John. John and I used to collect when we were kids back in high school. I got a, I'll have to share a photo. I got a photo of me as a youngster on Pittsburgh Pirates photo day. With the, I got a, one with the Cobra, one with uh, Willie Stargell, one with Omar Marino, and one with Chuck Tanner. From the 79 season as well. Yeah, the co part Dave Parker. There's a new, there's a new uh, he's got a memoir con out this year that I'm really looking forward to getting a hold of. Okay, we got a clear cut. Oliver Bjorkstrand, clear cut. You can see the hand right through it. Columbus, the Blue Jackets. Columbus is going out to Cody Moyer. There you go, Cody. Check that out, bud. I love those, the acetates. Congratulations, Cody. We got some, there's some interesting cards in this, in this box here. Maybe this is the box. Maybe this is the box. Maybe we get the Young Gun. Maybe we get the Lafreniere. Fingers crossed. Marcus Johansson, Dylan Strom, Adam Fox. Well, there's a Lafreniere, but it's the checklist. Still, that is a, a, a dual Rangers checklist there. New York Rangers, the New York Hockey Rangers. Uh, Kay Erickson, one of our newer breakers. So it gets a Lafreniere out of there. That's not the Lafreniere, but it is a Lafreniere. We've pulled that one a couple of times now. We're looking for his solo rookie. Chris, so what you have to do, Chris, is you have to buy into the break to get a team. And then we get do some uh, giveaways at the end with jerseys and pucks and things like that. So that's how you win. You have to purchase a spot in the break. And then you get the cards no matter what, and you have the opportunity to uh, win some other prizes as well. If you're interested, just uh, drop a little note here in the chat. It says you're interested, and I will send you some information to tell you how you might be able to get in. So um, if you are interested, just drop a quick little thing that says, says, I'm interested, and I will reach out to you and let you know how to get involved with this. Sound good? Sounds good. John Carlson, predominant for the Capitals. Martin Jones. Cool, Chris, gotcha. I will uh, shoot you. There's a couple other people out there that, have, or that are just tuning in tonight, too, for the first time that are interested. I will shoot you guys some uh, information later on about our private breakers page. And that's where we release all the information about everything we're doing in advance before it goes out to the general public. And that way you guys have a first shot at it. We always give our 
our folks that are really involved first shot and then uh, if anything's left which it usually isn't you guys usually gobble everything up we reach out to the general public but we have some fun we talk some hockey we open some trading cards we give away some jerseys it's a good time Oh, that's cool, Carl. When I used to do that, I used to have a, and I know I threw this away years ago because it was beat up. I had a, uh, like an 85, 86 hockey box that had like Mario on the bottom, which I should never have gotten rid of, but it was so badly beaten up that I just couldn't hold on to it anymore. It was falling apart. But I love the, how the boxes used to do that, puts a couple extra cards on the bottom. Leon Dreisaitl and the portraits. We still, uh, I think we still have three or four young guns to come. It looks like we might have something in this one. Bobrovsky. Fill the thrill. Ooh, boy. We need that red light. We need that red light from you, Vasilios. There is the A-Mail Larmy. We have just hit the bounty. The A-Mail Larmy bounty right there we are giving away an extra jersey tonight just for you guys congratulations a mill army we have done it finally after all of these weeks two jerseys there we go a mill army <coughs> excuse me so excited there you go we are giving away the larmy jersey tonight is actually Right over in my closet. I will grab it and show it to you guys in just a bit. Bounty time. That will be a separate giveaway from all of our other prizes. We will. What we'll do is once we are done here, we will raffle off our regular jersey. Then we will do a separate giveaway for everybody in this break for the Amil Army jersey. Congratulations. We did it. We did it. There we go. So we are going to put Mr. Alarmy. To the side here we have done it we are giving away an extra jersey tonight awesome now if we pull a lafreniere that would really make the night wouldn't it let's keep it going we got the we got the hot hand now a meal army very cool so we are gonna pull some extra stuff tonight another key for bellows Another key for Bellows as well. That is for the Islanders. That's for Brittany. What a night. So we're going to have some fun with this, guys. We are going to have some fun coming up. Two breaks, three jerseys tonight. How do you like that? Thomas Hurdle. Tuka Rask. Zach Cassian, look at, oh, that's a cool shot there. Snowing right over the goaltender's glove. <laughs> I don't know if I have two jerseys. I might have to wait till the end of the season to give you one of those from this year. Oh, Christina. As you never know. You never know. But we still have a, you know, maybe we'll pull a couple more boxes of the AHL product there and still roll with the DeSmith. The DeSmith bounty. But we have hit it. We have got a little bit of fun coming up here. Connor Hellebuck. Look at that. That's a cool shot there. Well, Nicholas, we can't really do a bounty. We can guarantee that there's going to be a card to him in every box of AHL. And we could do it with, I don't have any jerseys of his to, to do a bounty with, or, you know, it would be something to look into. But only got a couple, of, uh, we could always do a bounty on him with another player's jersey or something, but wouldn't be nearly as special. 
wouldn't be nearly as special. Let's see here. Jacob Chikrim. We got the NHL Worldwide. Thomas Hurdle there for San Jose. Ryan O'Reilly. I do, Carl. Through Flair. Yeah, I know, Nicholas, but uh, so he's in this series, but we don't have a, a P.O. Joseph jersey to give away. So it's hard to do a bounty if we don't have a jersey for the guy, you know? But we'll see. We'll come up with our fun, other fun ways to reward you guys and have some fun. Connor McMichael there for a, a Young Guns for the Capitals. So that is going out to Washington is for Brandy. There you go, Brandy. Gino. Four packs left here, and then we'll get into some more the, the giveaways for tonight, including the big bounty hit. The big bounty hit. We've been looking for it for a couple of weeks now. We finally hit it. Emil Larmy. Andrei Vasilyevsky Dazzlers there for Tampa. Tampa Bay, that's for Timmy, Tim D. Congratulations, Tim. Let's see what else we got in here. Three packs left, and then we have the fun. Liam Foudy for Columbus. Columbus is going out to, let's go into Cody. Alex Stalock, Bo Horvat, Yamamoto, Mitch Marner, down to the final two packs. Then we'll clear the field here. We'll do our regular giveaway, and we will wrap it up with the annual Larmy Bounty Giveaway. What do you say? Jason Zucker, Chris Letang. Final pack of the night. And then the big show. Looks like we got another, uh, we got another insert there to wrap things up. To bring cat Jordan Binnington for St. Louis. That's going to go nice with that short print we pulled out of there. Barkov. And there you go. So we hit the bounty. We hit the bounty. We hit the A Mill Army bounty there. It's not an auto or anything like that, but it's going to be the biggest hit we have tonight. Very cool. Let's get some things organized here first before we jump into our giveaways. So that we are not messing anything up here. Okay. So, let's get organized here. Let's settle down for a minute, Brian. There's our boxes. That's break one and break two. Emil Army's going to go in break two. We're going to leave him out here for good luck right now. So first things first here. Let's do our jersey giveaway. So we're going to just grab – this is going to be the regular – oh, actually, first we need to pull up the master list of jerseys. So let me take out the Drozg. And we will pull Let me share the screen with you guys here. So here are the jerseys that are available. We've taken out the droves that we get that we're giving away 
in the first one here, and this is how we're going to randomize and decide the jersey we're giving away for the second regular break here. So 13 on the randomization. Let's get them rolling. Thanks, as always, guys, for joining the, in tonight, buying into the breaks, having some fun with us, keeping me going here. I enjoy opening them up for you. Chris Brown, yellow jersey. Chris Brown, a ye yellow brown. Get it? So a yellow brown jersey is what we are giving away here. I'm going to add some columns after here. So the yellow brown, actually, go to my other spreadsheet. I got so many spreadsheets going on here that it's hard to keep track here. So yellow brown jersey. And then we're going to. Grab the players, the participants, if you will. So there you go. It's a little choppy again with the names, but you guys will get the gist of it as we do the giveaways here. So good luck to everybody. Don't go anywhere yet, Brad. Actually, yeah, before we go, that's, I, I am the Blake Jameson, the Tops 51 is coming out tomorrow. I am interested in that, Carl. Looks like a fun product for baseball fans. So if you guys are baseball fans, Tops has a new thing coming out tomorrow for Blake Jameson, who's an artist who was involved with the, the uh, 2020 project that they did. And it looks like a fun little set that you can collect here. So here we go. This is for the regular jersey. So this is a 14. Good luck, everybody. This is for the Chris Brown. Christopher Brown, as he liked to go by, just to not be confused with the rapper. Six rounds left. Five, four, three, two, one. Here we go. Good luck to everybody. Brad, my main man, Brad, you got the first one. Corey D., Nicholas, Jeremy, and Vasilios with runner-up prizes. So, Brad, one of our newer breakers. Congratulations, buddy. You're taking home a jersey. And now, before we get going here, let me pull the jersey out of storage here. I've been holding on to this in my office for the last couple of weeks, hoping that we would give it away. Hey, Mill Army. Let's get a good look at it here before we. So there it is. Amil Army. White penguin jersey. <laughs> it is beautiful. And we are giving it away to one of you guys right now. So that first, uh, that last uh, randomization there, just so if you want to go back and check it, V-A-Z-H-C-A. We are just going to do a new giveaway right now. Those same names in there. Put them all. Actually, I got to go back to the spreadsheet and grab them all again. One second, guys and gals. Okay. So we are putting them all in there. This is for the Amiel Army Bounty Jersey that we are giving away right now. We hit the bounty tonight after several weeks of looking. We're going 12 on that randomization. Good luck to everybody. Thanks for being part of it. Here we go. You guys deserve this one for sure. Amiel Army, we got six rounds. Five, four, three, two, one. One, and here we go. Jeremy, Jeremy, again, there you go, Jeremy. You are the winner of the Amil Army Jersey Bounty. Congratulations, buddy. We will be getting in touch with you in the very near future. So, big night. <laughs> you wish. <laughs> 
So Jeremy is the winner tonight. We will be getting that one out to him in the near future. We'll be getting your cards out to you guys again. <coughs> Excuse me. Coming up here this week. But that's going to do it for tonight. A big night of giveaways and fun. Congratulations to everybody. Thanks for being a part of it. Carl, one of these days. But I'm glad that you're a good sport about it. And you have fun with us and you're back here. And you have, I hope you have a really happy birthday. Um, so everybody, uh, thanks again for tuning in. All you newbies out there that are interested, I will get in touch with you and let you know how to get involved. And until next week, uh, you guys stay safe out there. Have fun. Don't forget to tune in the pens tomorrow. I know we'll all be watching. And I will post some information about when our next break is going up in the very near future on our breakers page. So thanks a lot, guys. Have a great night. We'll see you later on. Take care. Bye-bye.